Holly hanging across the door. Neighbors singing tales of yore. It's so close, hardly can wait. Waking up on Christmas. Children dreaming. Good morning. It looks like I'm in the middle of a forest, but I'm currently heading to Jimmy and Nara's wedding. I was following two other people who look like wedding guests, but I just lost them. And I'm very concerned. Oh, is it this way? Okay, I think I found it. I just made the trek back to my car and as you can see I am bringing one of the flower arrangements back home with me hopefully it doesn't knock over while I'm driving because there's some really beautiful flowers at the front here but I'm so scared they're gonna get squashed on the way hopefully not <laughs> I was made it safely back home. I have a band-aid on my forehead right now because it's really stupid but I burnt my forehead using the curling iron this morning. I managed to cover it up with concealer for the wedding but I just removed it and stuck a band-aid on it because I didn't want it to get infected or something. I was thinking that today we do a little Christmas decorating. It's December after all. I managed to dig out some decorations. This is my Christmas tree. Some Christmas ornaments. And then over here I've also got some red ribbon, fairy lights. And I found my Christmas alpaca from a few Christmases ago. This can go on the couch for now. For the shooting star. Holy night. Send me someone to love so I can hold their hand while we Skating around the trees, Central Park. Kiss some under the mistletoe. Oh, I want a Christmas kind of spot. Santa Claus, do you know Cupid? Send his arrow straight to my heart. Waterfall in love this Christmas. Santa, that would be the greatest gift of all. Christmas in Australia. <laughs> Okay everyone, I just gave the room a quick clean and we are ready to show you guys. I tried putting tinsel on that entertainment unit earlier but it looked kind of tacky so I just took it down. This is the finished look. Thinking once these flowers die, I'll probably move the Christmas tree back there so that it doesn't feel like it's taking up too much space. Now that the tree is up, apartment is decorated, I'm gonna move on to the balcony which is a place that I've been talking about doing up ever since I moved in. Little balcony set up. We have the camping table, chairs, we have some plants over there, a little Disney locker, and these are my string lights that I strung up last night. It's not dark enough for them to turn on yet, but once they do, it'll look so vibey. I'm so excited.
every time I look in the mirror or like in the viewfinder, I'm like, oh my god, this looks, looks like so stupid. Like in anime, every time there's a character who's like rolled and like it's in fights, they always have a band aid on their, on their face. forehead. I feel like it should be like, yeah. Your like yeah, yeah, you're like a little rascal. <laughs> I look like a rascal. Mm -hmm. <laughs> We've been talking about having this barbecue on mm -hmm. my balcony the entire year, and it's finally, finally happening. Shawrid and Hockneck. Do you like the scene? Yeah, let's do let it. <laughs> well, you have so much. Why is it so big? Costco, bye. <laughs> We're all set up. Look at these vibes. Waiting for the sunset now so that the lights can turn on. I got a look so good. It's going. Yeah, oh, it's smoke so good. Healed so I can finally stop wearing those silly band-aids on my head. But um, it's lunchtime right now. I have some leftover side dishes and some rice here. So I'm gonna throw together a simple bibimbap. I haven't had this in a while, so I'm abnormally excited. <laughs> And then I remembered I have this one cookie recipe that I've saved since like last year and haven't had a chance to make it yet. It's a gochujang cookie, which sounds really weird, like it shouldn't taste good. But then if you think about it, it could possibly taste amazing. I just so happened to have all the stuff in my pantry, which I was very surprised about because usually a lot of baking recipes need a lot of specialty ingredients. But this one was just all really basic stuff plus gochujang. So I guess I'll finish my lunch and I'll see you guys later to bake cookies. <laughs> It is baking time. I've got the recipe pulled up here. Gochujang caramel cookies. Oh my god! I was meant to separate the butter. Santa, won't you listen to me? I got a feeling that you just might agree. You know I haven't been good, but have I been so bad? Gotta have a gift for me too in that bag. You let me explain. Mm. I thought these rules of yours were just fun and games. So I'm a little bit naughty, maybe not very okay, nice. Is but there must be a gift for me in that bag tonight. Mm. Oh, come on, let me take a quick peek inside. That old bag of yours, what you trying to hide? A box of chocolates, or perhaps a big screen TV? Or some shiny silver keys to a new car, maybe? Santa, I think we both already know You're gonna give me something good when you go Keep those two turtle doves I'm so excited 
it guys I just had a sneaky little taste of the cookie dough left in the bowl that already tasted so good so I can only imagine how good this cookie is gonna taste <laughs> Oh my god, they look so beautiful! <sighs> Do a little quick outfit change because while we are waiting for these delicious cookies to cool, I am going to go take a walk outside. It's still really hot, but thankfully not 40 degrees anymore. I think it's like 30 something. So we are gonna go hit our daily step count. You guys probably noticed earlier, but I finally set up my Pixel watch and it's really keeping me on track. So we're gonna head outside to hit today's 10K and hopefully catch a nice sunset while we're at it. received a package from Castlery. They sent me a Christmas present, I think. Wishing you a happy holiday season and joyous new year. Let's see what we've got in here, hey? <gasps> wow. I thought this was a blanket at first, but it's a tote bag. Oh, that's so cute. And then on this side, I believe these are candles. <gasps> wow. Candles from Mirapu. Thank you so much, Castlery. You know what time it is. Whenever I bake anything, I always eat the ugly ones first. But they all look so good, so I don't know where to start. Let's go with this one. Jen. I'm gonna pour myself a glass of milk with this. <gasps> Guys, they came out. Perfect. Like a really good salted caramel cookie with like just the right amount of cake to it. And I love how chunky it came out. Mmm. Mm, so Santa, I've been good this year. Make your list and check it twice. I'll leave you a note right here. Underneath the Christmas light. Carols and bells, none of them help. <laughs> 